and the cat roll and the dog just roll over the cat. Who says who's that bad cat? And you know, first I said to myself, my God, look how God revealed. God said, you're a puss and a dog and tell us how we live. Mm. What I'm saying to us is Jesus pointed to his life. Last week I had preached to them swear. And I shared with them that when I was growing up and walking to church with my sibling and my mother, we surpassed a man. No, I didn't, I didn't see him, I just hear his voice. Beyond a fence, as in fence, I think. No, it's not country coming. As in fence. Every Sunday morning, the brother preached, live for self and live in fear. Live for Christ to live again. As a little boy growing up, I wonder what kind of I want to listen to. He would be preaching those 13 words on the top of his voice in a change of me. He was so consistent every Sunday morning. And I mean just passed if he used to the him again. And he was saying, Live for self to live in here. Live for Christ to live. Jesus is true life. In this life, we try to live it up. But if in this life we are not living it up in and through Jesus, you ain't the way. I am the way, the truth, and the life. This kind of statement of Jesus so positions us that are not in the way. We have to get ourselves in the way. I don't know who I'm talking to. But also maybe reminding us, those of us who are in the way, to follow him in the way. Is the truth, believe me, there are truths that will come our way, but they are only philosophical and ideological and theological. But if we understand that Jesus is the truth, he's trustworthy, he's God, he cannot lie, believe him. And since we choose to follow him and believe him, then we will have life in him. I am the life. Let us live in him for Christ's sake. Amen.
see that thing? Okay. The Lord, go ahead, my brother. Let us pray. Sovereign Lord, we give you thanks for your daughter and your sons. We have lifted up your hands upon us, declaring that the Lord will with you. We give thanks to God for your lives and the ways in which you will minister. We give thanks to God for his hand in order that means something good in your sin will happen. Lord, your daughter and your son, they have been walking with you. You know them, but you know why they're here. We ask for God that you continue to minister to them. Lord, we give you thanks for the way in which you have ministered unto us from inside this place, beholding your presence, your revealed self. We ask for God that as we prepare to leave this space and place, that, oh God, we will not leave without you, but that we will experience in all your glory. Continue to speak to our hearts, speak to our Lord, God, we pray. And the others, as they make this commitment and renew the commitment to walk with you and to stay the way. These we ask now through the Son's name. Amen. Rosie, Dwayne, Ron, my brother, don't leave. I come to love. We stand with you. The others are asking me. Please keep standing by the bench. Go with it. Go with it. Go with it. Now may the God of peace, who brought again from the dead our Lord Jesus, the great shepherd of the sheep, by the blood of the eternal covenant, equip you with everything good to do his will, working in you that which is pleasing in his sight through Jesus Christ, to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. Amen. This session I can stand up for Jesus. We're going to sing the first in the stanza, and the musician are going to continue to play as we leave in the presence and with the presence of the Lord. Mm -hmm. 